everybody. I'm going to be doing a back to school supplies haul today. So I went to Walmart, Target, and Staples. But first I'm going to show you the stuff that I have left over from last year. And if you see me like looking off to the distance, like over here or like right there, it's because I have one of those cameras with like the side thing on it and I stare at myself just to see what's in the frame and stuff. And I talk with my hands and I touch my hair get over it. <laughs> Left over from last year is just this jumbo stretchable book cover that I never even use. And I have another one, but I don't know where it's at. <laughs> I just have some post-it notes. Oh, just spell. Where it says, study where I left off on it on the test, if you can see it. So it's pretty cool. Of course, I have some whiteout. I was going to move it in closer, but I'm not going to. Then I have a Staples Butter Binder. It's just one inch that I barely used last year. And then I just have some loose leaf paper from Walmart. Just college rolled notebook paper from previous years. I have... I'm just going to move it over here. I have an index card holder with index cards. As you can see, they're really pretty colors. I have some... Big pens. They're just red. It's a 12 pack. And then I just have a dictionary, a thesaurus, and a Spanish dictionary. Um, a post it note cube thing with all those pretty colors. Then I have this pencil case, which my aunt bought me, so I don't know where it's from. Inside, I just have my calculator from previous years. It looks like a really ugly green, but it's lime green, so it's pretty cute. These are the three pencils that I use, like the same kind of brand. There's Papermate, Bic, and then like Bic Velocity. And I have more in my little storage thing up there. I just didn't feel like bringing them all down. And then I have like animal print pens that write in black. I'm going to move you in. Yeah, animal print pens that write in black. Um, profile pens from Papermate, but they're in all different colors. And just uh, regular Bic pens, like the red ones, but in black and blue. That's all that's in there. I have just a pink composition notebook. I have one in green, too. My blue and my yellow one that I bought, um, I'm using them different stuff. One's my YouTube one, so please request videos. Um, I will gladly make them. So then left over, I have just college roll paper for geometry again. Just, you know, from yours. Then last year I got these two reinforced paper from Target, and they're just college rolled. And this is for Spanish and uh, chemistry. Then I have five notebooks, one in gray, one in green, one in blue. It looks purple, but it's blue. Um, one in pink, and one in black. And I actually bought 12 notebooks last year. I used both my yellow ones. I just fell out. Ow! I just got hit by thumbed. I'm just going to put that up right there. That really hurt. But I bought 12 last year and I used my yellow ones and of course one of the each last year. So I just have like extra paper just to like do homework. I bought more of those big pencils that I like. Um, if you want to know the prices just leave a comment below or message me or something and I'll try to figure it out. Um, I think these were like 119. I'll try to say them, but if I just skip something, you know, just write me down below. I got two packs of Sharpies for a dollar each. I got Papermate pens and like more colorful pens, but these ones don't click and they were really cheap. They're five dollars for, you know, 18 pens. If you don't believe me. And they all write in their color, so it's pretty cool. I got a purple note. I have a purple notebook and I put the zebra print there. It's just duct tape. And it's in college ruled. 
I like bright paper. And it was 75 cents. I had this bird notebook that was $3 and it's by, I don't want to say it because I can never pronounce it right, Sas Sasquatch? Yeah, I can't pronounce it. But um, this one's wide ruled and it's for my Spanish class because like you write really big in Spanish. Well, I do. I write really big period. But I like college ruled because it helps me like stay in the lines. And that was $3. And then I got two uh, five star folders in green and purple and they both look like this on the inside with like index card holders these were two dollars each and then i got a 15 cent blue folder for the first day of school because at my school we don't have a school supplies list so i kind of just went off of what i did last year in high school i am a sophomore in high school this year so Boop, boop. People tell me it's the hardest year of my, like, in my school, it's the hardest year is your sophomore year. I got Sharpie colorful pens, and they're in, like, turquoise, like, a minty green, but it says clover on here, coral, and hot pink. These are $5. I got myself a planner. Our school provides planners, but I just like to be organized myself, so... You know, I thought it'd be good. And they just look like that. And then like that on both sides. This was five dollars as well. Um, my highlighters that I have are five dollars. And they're just, you know, in those pretty colors. There's twelve of them. I have the clicky ones that come in an eight pack from last year. Um, but I'm keeping them for at home so whenever I study at home I can just, you know, run them down and like highlight stuff. And then I got two notebooks that I'm going to be using this year for sure. Is They're both five star and they're college rule notebooks. Um, I got one in orange. Just like that, you know. Not bright, but it's like the brightest five star paper I can find. And then I got one in teal. So. So I went to Staples and these were $2. They're just owl erasers. They were so cute. I got an owl card index holder. An owl index card holder. And that was, I think, like a dollar, maybe a dollar fifty. I think it was a dollar. Um, I got this composition notebook for Spanish. And it's wide ruled. And it was 99 cents. All my folders that I got were 99 cents, and I got four of them. I got an owl one. It looks like that, I mean, like this on the inside. It's green. It's lime green. It just looks like an ugly green on my camera. Trust me, it's pretty. I got a fruit one, which I thought would be great for art. You know how artists like to like paint fruit bowls. I thought it was really cute. And then I got this one. This one's for government, and it's like teal and has all these like pretty little flower things on the inside. And then this one, as you, can you see that the, like, the purple's metallic? So cute. And this is for my English class, my English 2 class. I got two binders, and they were having a sale two for ten, so I, of course I got two because they were really good binders. And they're both one inch. Um, they're both better binders. And this one is blue with green sparkles, if you can see. No, you can't. But they're green sparkles with green lining. And then, this is like my favorite binder. Um, an owl one with like yellowish, greenish side thing. And then inside, I just have tab dividers with pockets from last year that I never used. And this is for my Spanish class. So... I encourage you guys to, you know, like, go buy stuff, like, ahead. So, um, I hope you guys enjoy. This is my first video on my back-to-school series, so stay tuned for all my other ones, like my makeup tutorials, my hair tutorials, and my back-to-school fashion lookbook and hauls because, um, oh, that's a deeper story. I'll tell you guys later. But, uh, please comment, rate, and subscribe. Bye, guys!